Gear. Oh, the music stopped, right? <sighs> Come on, man. You're killing me. Gears 5. It's time to finish the fight. Is that the <clears throat> the thing for this game? I don't think so. Okay, so just going to watch the credits, and then we're going to save, play, finish the game. All right, so here we go. Let's, like, check on the state of the universe. Should we watch these in left to right order? Let's previously on. Let's see what, what what's the important beats. Previously on Gears. Presented by Kate. I think Kate's the main character in this game. We used to protect Cox settlements. Now we're about to raid one. <laughs> Raiding is what outsiders do. Lieutenant, you've been busy. Look, our village hasn't had power in weeks. We need this fabricator. I don't care about the goddamn fabricator. You're taking the G Dang people. fabricator. Come on. What happened? The short version. The cop is on his way. Talk you here. promised me you could steal that fabricator without provoking Jin. This has nothing to do with a the fabricator. Then what did you do? Jin accused us of taking her people. Yeah, whatever that means. Get the fabricator to the power station and install the inverter. You realize Jin's coming back, right? We need to leave now. Mom! Hey, listen. You need to hide, and then you need to run. Oh no, oh no. Mom! That's funny. I forgot. I remember most Look, of the time. I played through this I part recently. That he can help. Our village was attacked. And my mother was taken. Taken. D taken. Yeah, and you should look at this. Shit. Uh, guys? Thought you said you weren't running from the cop. Yeah, that wasn't completely accurate. Oh, I can't wait to use these dumb guns again. on the other side. Swarms related to the grubs will find out there. Oh no. 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 Take it, people, and use them. And what if we can't get him back? Then I guess we're all alone out here. But Oh yeah, these things. Right. We definitely found where they're coming from. And where those snatchers are going. My dad's alive and he's down there. He's down there. All right, this part. This is just like an all cutscenes movie. James, in that pod. I was in their network. This is all goddamn hive. It's all connected. The locusts never die, James. Kate, your mother, she's alive. Where is she? And she's not being treated like the others. Not potted. I'm at least. I'll die. It's okay. She wanted you to have that. It was my grandmother's. I never knew her. Oh shit. That's kind of like the important. Wow. There's like an entire chapter, I think, that was just not there because, you know, whatever reason. On planet Sarah, things were not always peaceful. For year after bloody year. Human settlers fought each other in pendulum wars, a brutal struggle for control over a new energy source called emulsion. After eight decades of conflict, a coalition of ordered governments eight emerged decades. triumphant. However, victory by the Khan did not bring peace because a new threat was coming. Just six short weeks after the end of the Pendulum Wars, locust! the vicious locust horde erupted from underground caverns, slaughtering everyone in its path. And they got Kim. Locust troops have breached the court. Oh my God, that's Anya. What became known as Emergence Day was the start of a new conflict. One oh my God, they updated that cutscene. Was in no way prepared. Imagine that. 
Serving as a gear in the COG army, Sergeant Marcus Phoenix became a fixture in the front lines of the Locust War. I feel like this narrator sounds a lot like Dom. Well, that's one thing we agree on. For 10 years, Phoenix fought in battle after battle. 10 years? His stature only grew when he was imprisoned for disobeying orders after a futile attempt to save his father, Professor Adam Phoenix. I've come to get you out of here. I've got to save my research. Four years later, a desperate cog put Marcus back on the front lines. Welcome back to the army, soldier. Humankind was losing ground every day. They're flanking! Only one stronghold remained, the capital city of Jacinto. Then, on a mission into the heart of Locust territory, Phoenix made a shocking discovery. The Locust Horde was actually fighting a two-front war. Exposure to the emulsion energy source had transformed ranks of the Horde into a new threat, the Lambent. These monstrosities had been attacking the Locust for years, and so it became clear. Emergence Day was not an invasion. It was the Locust's attempt to escape an even more deadly foe. They're desperate. All this time, we never realized oh, I never realized Realizing this. humanity would never be able to defeat both the Locust and the Lambent by conventional means. I'm sorry. Phoenix proposed a radical solution. We need to sink Jacinto before the Locusts leave, not after. By sacrificing the last remaining human city, oceans would flood the underground caverns of Sarah, wiping out the Locust civilization. Two years later, human, locust, and lambent survivors alike battled for resources on the surface. <laughs> so much for diplomacy. Marcus I'm the cold train, baby. After a mysterious message revealed his father was alive and in desperate need of help. I need your help. Fighting across the shattered ruins of Sarah, Marcus eventually reunited with Adam Phoenix. Marcus. Lambency, Adam Phoenix revealed, was caused by the emulsion energy source. It's not a fuel, Marcus. It's a living organism. And so Adam Phoenix science, had science. the ultimate weapon, a countermeasure that would eradicate emulsion and the lambent threat, and in the process, end the locust once and for all. There's too many! Hold them off! Just hold them off! In a brutal final confrontation, Marcus Phoenix fended off the vicious locust queen as his father readied humanity's last chance at survival. The plan succeeded. The locust queen. Father and son triumphant, simultaneously wiping out all emulsion, lambent, and locust everywhere on Sarah. But this time, there was a terrible price to pay. Adam Phoenix had used emulsion on his own cells to study their devastating effects. Uh. Soon, father and son were torn apart for a second and final time. Alone in mourning, as the world celebrated the end of the Locust War, Marcus Phoenix saw little hope for the future and nowhere left to go. But after some time, Marcus started a new life with fellow soldier Anya Stroud. Eventually, they had a son, James Dominic Phoenix, better known to his friends and squadmates as JD. As the decades passed, the coalition of ordered governments reformed itself. Human civilization began to rebuild, and the Locust War became a distant memory. Until now, 25 years later, JD Phoenix has become a warrior in his own right and has uncovered a new threat, a mysterious race called the Swarm. JD? JD doesn't know what these creatures want or where they came from, but he knows he won't be able to face them alone. Dad! Once again, no. war has come to Sarah. Once again, a phoenix will rise to fight it. And Kate's there too. Never fight alone. Gears. Dude, cool. I hope this video doesn't get claimed because I just watched that entire thing basically without talking. All right. Now that we're all caught up, let's play the video game. Custom game? Okay. Wait, I want to play as the robot. Wait a minute. What? Insane. We're gonna play on beginner. <laughs> oh, everybody can be on different difficulties. That's so cute. I'm gonna join everybody's game and play on beginner. Uh, try in the dark. Okay, let's go. Dude, look at this countdown. This is like a menu for the campaign. 
it's like all sorted and like put together. Um, there was like a beginning tutorial thing that I skipped, which maybe I should do. I mean, I know how to play. I've been playing Gears of War recently, so I don't think I really need to need to. Previously, I'm Gears. just jump in. How hard could it be? Uh, well, I just want to get through the game fast. I don't care about it being hard. Like it being hard for me by myself, I have no interest in doing. It. If someone else wants to play with me and they want to play on like insane, I'm down to do it. I want to get the story though, you know. It's all about that hot lore. Look, our village hasn't had power in weeks. We need. Are we rewatching this cutscene? I don't care about the goddamn fabricator. You're taking my people. What happened? Short version, the cop is on Okay, we just watched that. <laughs> um, also, I would say that Insane in the last game was like really like weirdly difficult. I played all the previous games, or not all the previous, I played the previous one and two maybe on the hard, the hardest into Insane or whatever it was at the time. And like, man, I don't know. It's just not the same. And like I said, I'm down to do it with somebody else. Like if I get someone in here at some point and we play co-op, I'll, I'll, I'll I, I could be convinced to play it on Insane. I'm a beginner, I've never played third person shooter before. Shit, yeah. And then it seems that it's me. Well, look at these graphics. Kate is not ready for this. She can barely keep her eyes open. Don't worry about her. She'll be ready. All right, it's loud now. Okay, we're almost at Ben's coordinates. Yeah, they skipped it in. I just realized in the. It's clipping on the thing. That's bizarre. If there's crackling, it's the game. It's not me. When's the last time you slept? Last night. Got a good eight or nine minutes in. Nightmares. Does it get better? It gets tolerable. I don't know what this really is gonna be. Like the first game All just right. kind of ended. See what we got. doesn't seem secure at all. None of this seems secure. So who's jumping first? Definitely not you. Del, I'm fine, okay? Sure you are. Oh, shit. Thanks, Del. Sam, we're outgoing. 
Hey, Dave! Beeps. I want to play as Dave. Who am I going to play here? All right, Control. I'm We're playing as JD. In. Control, really? I have a name. <laughs> control. Regs of regs, Bear. I mean, Control. And yeah, we're already breaking enough of them as it is. What Jin doesn't know won't hurt her. This is my call, all right? If the First Minister doesn't like it, she can yell at me. Which she almost certainly will. Tell us where to go, Control. I'll do my best, but remember, no one's been in that facility for like 25 years. Yeah, that's pretty evident. Get out there to buy a timeshare. Get in and launch an old hammer of non prototype. And your intel says one of the silos is still intact, right? Yeah, as far as they can tell. Just get Dave to a functional control room. He'll handle the. Wait a minute. Sequence. What's up with this? Secret? Secret? Collectible. Cool. Great. I hate it already. It's looking pretty good. I was actually going to play this on my computer because uh, it scales. Uh, Windows 10 games tend to scale really well. This is no exception. Seemed like it. You a rainbow. Birds. How'd you like Ghost Recon? Um, well, it was very broken. That's not good. I take cover here. I'm trapped. I can't get out now. It was very broken, and that was uh, quite unfortunate. Light. Huh. Remember. Big local sparrow sight in the silence. Hatched? Hey, get back! Oh, shit! Help. Cool. Uh, I need to search a place that's falling apart. Quickly. Um, I'm not I'm really the biggest fan of, like, the... From here. It seems a little... half-baked. Well, half-baked plans are kind of Baird's specialty. How Baird even figured out they had a hammer sight like my father, before he died, he let Baird in on a few cog secrets in this island. There's plenty of them. Oh. Get that, get that, Dave. Wait, if someone plays this character, what do they do? They just fetch ammo? Look at the cursor on this uh, gun. Yeah, otherwise, like, the game has seemed fine. It seems like very much like Wildlands, which is the last game. That wasn't um this one or uh, breakpoint. Uh, didn't expect there'd still be bodies. Only a handful of us made it off as we're alive. But I I find that in general I don't like the weird RPG elements. I normally don't in games now. Cause like I don't know. There's like manual dexterity applied when aiming and shooting a gun in a video game, and so for the game to just be like actually like your gear score is like one too low so you're just gonna like eat shit it's like really frustrating um especially when you encounter like a high level just like a person you're just like that's just a dude gotta cut through wait rb okay let's go dave pulse dave pulse Oh, cool. Stay back. We're coming down. That's loud, isn't it? This game is like all over the place with the volume. All right, let's go. When do I shoot something? Huh, guess who? Dave, send a pulse and let's see what we're dealing with. Ah, there they are. Okay, let's put him down. Get into cover. He just knocked that pillar over. Sorry, I'm gonna use the control stick. The aim is quite floaty. Whoa, the aiming. Oh, that's right. I can just active reload whenever I want. High ground on the left. Flank up. 
flank him. Oh, okay, flank him. Got it. Can I flank him over here? You just lied to me. Dude, what a headshot sound. Wow. The reload felt laggy. So the controller stick on this is, I'm finding to be quite loose. Which I think is a me problem. All right, that's all of them. Target lock. On beginner difficulty, assisted target snaps you on enemies. Fantastic. If it's currently enabled. If you want to turn it off. Nah, it's cool. Baird? I'm good. Confirmed. Zero burial site is active. Hammer burst. Okay, condors in the air. Let me know if you need I'm gonna use a hammer burst. We get it handled for now. Delta out. Come on, we gotta find one of those silos. Assuming the swarm haven't ripped them all apart. Okay, hey, now it's I think quiet. we can get down this way. What about up here? Oh, nothing? Okay. Lift efforts. <laughs> Headache pain. Shit. Sorry. Shit, sorry. Okay, hey, these headaches. I'm okay, all right? Let's just find a silo. For the record, you don't seem okay. I'll live. There's too many active hives. Everywhere we go, another burial site's hatched. All the more reason to get the hammer of dawn online. Let's hope Jin sees it that way. Okay, it looks like there's a... Oh, let's execute this guy. Oh, right. When when do you get a frag in that thing? Let's take the big. All right, frag grenade. Frag. Drop one. Dropped one. It's so loud now. It doesn't know if it wants to be loud or not. All right, we got them all. All right, let's just chainsaw our way through this nice. if we're gonna, you know. Guys, we're in the asylum. Uh, we found one of the silos, but it's Well, there's two more. One of them's still operational. Hope you're right. We ended the war once on this island. When we get this hammer satellite up, we can do it again. That's we can do idea, it again. I'm very bloody. So... It's not an option. How much rocket base is even left? Let's find out. You guys go right, Marcus and I will go left. We'll find those silos. Sounds good. Stay in contact. Yes. Are you sure about this? Stay in contact. Silos, two paths. You got a better idea? Just in case someone gets a jump on me, you know, I'll be ready. Oh, what's that? Oh, a retro lancer. Hell yeah. Hey, fashion. Say that. Hell yeah. Down. Hatch. Jump down. Just jump down. This looks like some kind of exhaust stuff. Is it from a silo? Only one way to find out. Oh my god, this is so loud. Yeah, where are you gonna go, buddy? Where'd it go? You know, I, 
I think I've got the melee thing happening. Easy is hilarious. Oh, I'm having issues. Whoa, whoa. whoa. It's like AoE associated with the melee melee. Yo, come at me, bro. I wonder how this part is in Unsane. Okay, no, we're we're turning all the sound effects down. That is obnoxious. It's kind of incredible how like badly like kind of done that. It's like incredibly loud compared to everything else. Oh my god, is that like what? What slider is that associated with, dude? Is it environmental volume? It's so loud! Fuck off! Oh my god, all right, we're just gonna try every single slider until we can find it. Maybe it's dialogue. I hope it's not. It's still loud. Let's just, let's just get out of here because this part is obnoxious. Oh my god, it's like piercing. Maybe environmental? Okay, it's not that. Maybe it's character dialogue. Wait, it's character dialogue? Go fuck yourself, really? What do I gotta put it at? Like a two? Oh my, that's two! That's what it sounds like at two! Oh, maybe that's because I, I put effects up. Oh, except now I can't hear Dell. Great. This is awful. All right, whatever. It looks like this gates are way up. Now I have to put it back up because I need to hear them talking. All right, here's what we'll do. Next time those enemies are on the screen, I'm just going to mute the entirety of the game. Dave, can you get this open? Man, you know what? If they want to turn this place into a hive, let them. It's an isolated island hundreds of miles from shore. Uh-huh. Let's just make sure that happens after we leave. Why is this one all glowy? See? Dave gets it. Okay. Whee! Uh, going down! Oh, cool. Uh, so much for a silo. Under here. Oh man, we got company. Swarm snarls. That guy's naked. James, we're above you. I see. You. We can provide support from up here if things get Okay. Or we can alert them now. Okay, just tell us who to shoot. Wait, what just anybody shoot? Next! <laughs> Oh, we got a nest. Toss a frag. Close it up. Cool. Focus fire on that drone. What do you mean focus fire? Just shoot them. Neutralize. They're not even shooting him. Is that a boom shot? Why is there a boom shot right here? Nice. 
Hey, Bolt! I got him! Oh my god, this controller, I'm so bad with it. I don't know what it is about this controller, but it's like really loose. What do you mean you're hurt? What the fuck are you doing? I see you. Coming. Okay, well. Bell got run pretty good. Yeah, because he like walked up to a guy with a shotgun. What do you think was gonna happen, buddy? Are there more people? I'm confused. Oh, there are. Here. You two push ahead. Copy that. Who on? Swarm. Maybe I should just utilize the auto aim. Oh, it's not actually that aggressive. It's not like a ghost recon auto aim where it super snaps onto people. Call, dude. There they are, finally. Aerial operations is now secure. Thank you for your assistance in this matter. Hey, control, that carrier's down. Thanks for the help. DBs, one of you secure the area. The other's with us. Let's go. Acknowledged. Hell yeah! I like these dudes. These dudes are cool. Nope, locked. We'll have to find another way to open it. Want to be in here? Check that panel. Dave. Touch that thing. Hell yeah, dude. Got a, a pet Whoa, Delta. drone. What the hell did Dave do? Got a lot of strange data here. Top secret stuff. Uh, as far as I know, he's opening a door. He's doing a lot more than that. Well, either way, the door's open. Thanks, Dave. Thanks, Dave. So, that data Dave just downloaded? There's a big hole at the highest security clearance. How does this relate to our mission? It doesn't, but now I need to know. I'm guessing whatever's missing was pulled from the network. Well, who'd have the authority to do that? Back then, uh, only the facility commander. Find us a buffer. Oh, Lieutenant. Okay. Sustaining heavy damage, Lieutenant. Scanning immediate area. Detecting all inferior cause. Damn it! Jenny! We just lost our backup! Well, why'd the backup run in there? Got him. Seemed like a bad plan. Yeah, tell me why, like, when we were doing it in, like, horde mode before, they'd be, like, up in the sky, way in the back, you know? Being generally smarter instead of right in front of a bunch of shotgun guys. Like, come on, man. What the fuck did you think was gonna happen? I 
Mark him down. Isn't like a melee thing on this kind of weird? I would describe that as weird. Office is through here. This door is locked. Hey, touch the touch the door or whatever. What do you mean it's locked? Okay, not not in love with this so far. Dave, try that vent. See where it goes. Hey, Dave, so, to solve this problem. What's lost data, huh? What does it even look like? Well, I mean, if it got pulled from the network, it probably got stored on some kind of external drive. <laughs> Nice one, Dave. Yeah, I wonder what happens when a third player plays as Dave. Is it like serious shit? Yeah, nice one, Dave. Thanks. All right, commander's office. Let's look around. Safe. Good place for secret data. Gotcha. Hey, control. Good news. We found the data drive. Appreciate it, Delta. Hey, know what we'd appreciate? Some backup. What? Where are you? The silo. We found it. And they're all over us. Oh, shit. We're on our way. Oh, shit. I think this door is open. Kind of. Wow, it's a co-op door. That's hilarious. Dave, pulse. Shit, not this way. I mean, yeah, not this way. I'm looking for uh, collectibles. Yeah, let's pick up the boom shot. They clearly want us to have it. Nope, dead end. Dude, nope, dead end. Shut up. I'm like just turning around. There's probably collectibles here somewhere. Apparently there's not. All right. The second he says whatever, I'm just going to leave. Oh, explosive ammo, huh? Cool. Oh, shit. They weren't kidding. Man, we leave you guys alone for five minutes. Yeah, it's goddamn hilarious. Just help us clear them out. They didn't kill him. Yeah. <laughs> I missed. I don't want to talk about it. Target down. Man, this drop shot thing's kind of weird. Not now. Oh, okay. I forgot how to use this. I hate this gun. You can basically like shoot over right. cover with it. Control room's clear. Nice of you guys to show up. Oh, no problem. Is that rocket attack? It is, believe it or not. Good. Then find a port for Dave to plug into. If it checks out, he'll initiate the launch. <gasps> okay. Why can't Dave just do this? You know what it's I'm all saying? yours. Can I play as Dave solo? That'd be pretty great. Control, you're in. Start the launch sequence. Pressurized. First stage. Opening silo doors. Error. Error. Uh, Error. Delta, we have an issue. The silo hatch. It's not opening. Oh, of course. I knew that seemed too easy. Baird, options. Bug out. Blast doors aren't going to protect you from an exploding rocket. All right, then we call it. Let's go. Hydraulic external power to on. No. We get that hatch open. What? Kid, listen to your old man. You gotta get out of there. Damn it, we came here to do this, so let's get it done. Ignition test commence. We got the swarm! Beep, 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 beep. Dave, with me! Ignition, engine one. It wouldn't be funny if they just died. God damn it, James! Got to learn to stop following you. Yeah, good luck with that. Let's get that hatch open. 
Oh, I have the boom shot that I have. So what's our plan? I don't know. There's gotta be a manual override near the top. Let's find our way up. Hey, Paul. <laughs> Hmm. Damn it. Got him. Hey, lower that platform. Ignition. Engine two. That's not good. No, it is not. Oh, the platform's over here. Cool. Shit, we gotta hurry. What the hell, Sick? Shit, another gap. Ignition, engine three. Um, I don't really know what I'm looking for. Bring it down, Dave. Bring it down, uh, Dave. Now, how many engines does a rocket have? Usually four. Okay. Ignition, engine four. Oh, come on. God damn it, it's jammed. We can get around, let's go. We can get around. Boop, boop, boop. Whoa. Oh, I see. Coming in here with Good thing it came fully loaded. Why am I walking over that? I'm just kidding. I'm going to walk over. Got it. It's raining goddamn tubies. Shit. Come on. Oh, come on. You gotta go. Nice. Hurry! Ten seconds to launch. Dude! There's no time. Come on. Get him off, Dave. Huh? No! Dave's still out there. Five, Who gives a shit? Four, He's a robot. Three, That's not his fault. Two, one. Uh, gotcha! Lift off. That's not his fault. Unbelievable. He looks really different in this game. Sam, we're ready for extraction. But don't. Wow. If I saw that in real life, I don't, I don't know what I Welcome back, kids. Oh, one thing. Jim found out about our little vacation to Hammerland, and as I predicted, she's not happy. Now that she's done yelling at me, she wants to yell at you. All of you. <laughs> Roger that, Control. Come on, time to face the music. Dave! James, 
How about I see Jin first? I'll calm the storm before you brief her. I'm sorry, is this Sergeant Phoenix being diplomatic? You can call it what you want, but we're at war, even if it doesn't feel like it yet. We all have to be on the same page. Yeah, well, I mean, if you think it'll help, then sure. Wish you'd have been this willing to listen back at that silo. Hey, it worked out, didn't it? Listen, James, word of advice. Stop trying to prove yourself. Just do the job. Dad, I took a necessary risk. Necessary means you have no other option. That wasn't necessary, and you know it. What was that about? What do you think? Same thing it's always about. Hey. You know it's just because he cares, right? Yeah, well, you know a hell of a lot more about him caring than I would. Okay, um... Yeah, um, we're just gonna go inside. Come on, Dave. That was a shitty thing to say. Yeah. yeah um, I'm sorry. The thing is... You two are more alike than either of you want to admit. The data is in front of you, Damon. What? What? That's it? I thought the new satellite would automatically link to the old ones. It cannot find them. Without regular scheduling from telecommand, tracking accuracy <sighs> degrades. Thanks a lot, Iris. Your vocal sentiment does not match your word's literal meaning. Thus, you are not actually thanking me. Please stop me. talking. So, I still can't find the other Hammer of Dawn satellites. On the plus side, I accidentally invented an AI that understands sarcasm. Here, that data drive you wanted. Maybe it'll help. Find lost satellites? I doubt it. But I'll take a look. Wait, hang on. Did we do all that for nothing? Oh, it'll fire. But with only one working satellite up, it'll be tough to control the beam. Metallic thumping. Ah. Uh, What's wrong with Dave? Well, Dave had a few problems. What kind of problems? Hmm. Uh, that kind. Oh, I know I'm gonna regret this. <sighs> okay. Everyone, meet the new Jack. When the hell did you have time to build this? When did I have time to build this? This is what I do. I sit here making stuff you guys don't appreciate and inevitably break. Okay, so what's different about him? Whole new range of behaviors. Improved scanning, augmented combat and support modules. He's literally one of a kind. Mm -hmm. And... And he's... all yours. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have a bazillion 40-year-old satellites to find. Dave, bazillion. There are only 15 missing satellites. Thank you, Iris. More sarcasm to add to your growing library. Before we begin, Damon, the combat module you brilliantly designed is now ready. My use of brilliantly was intended to be sarcastic. God. Did I succeed? <sighs> Follow me. You'll want to equip this new module ASAP. It'll make Jack combat ready. Oh, I'm gonna dig this. Oh, is this where the RPG elements come in? Okay. Fantastic. It'll give Jack what I've been calling Flash. It blinds, stuns the enemy. Flash. Stuns enemies. Wait, there's still robots? Am I still gonna fight robots? Equipping an ability, Jack can have one assault and one support ability at a time. Open the menu, island ability, open the menu. It's the other one. Equip. Passives, huh? His health and ability to heal others. Oh. Stealth capabilities. Effective zapper. Enhances core systems. What the fuck does that mean? Does his core system, like, what's improved about him picking up a thingy? Installed and equipped. So, how do we use it? I'll show you. 
Over here. Hey, Jack, pulse. Okay. Grab a weapon and get into cover. Then we'll start the test. Got it. <clears throat> Iris, activate Alpha 331. Certainly, Damon. So, say you got a target that seems awfully comfortable behind cover. Jack's flash ability mm -hmm. fixes that. Aim at the DB and activate. See what Test sequence complete. Done. Huh. That could be useful. Now, let's try it again with multiple targets. Iris, activate Alpha 332. Incoming, Damon. Jack's got to reroute power between flashes. Once he's recharged, hit him again. Jack, pulse! Mm -hmm. Jack, look out. Jack, Fire. stop eating shit, Jack. Jack, take cover. Uh, Reload commencing. Oh, two for one. Nice. Nice work. Feel free to run it again if you want. No, I'm good, thank you. No. Test sequence complete. No offense, JD, but uh, Jack's my new best friend. Wow. I'm very happy for you, for both of you. But now I need you to return your weapons to the weapons locker and get out of here. Are you trying to get rid of us? Oh, you noticed. Anyway, you can boost Jack's abilities if you find the right components. Before you go see Jin, stop by the armory. They might have one you can borrow. Oh, we will definitely be doing that. Good. Now I can get back to work. What okay. Damon means to say is that he has more important things to do. I got Thank that. You, Iris. Later, Baird. Come on, guys. No worries. Do your thing. Come on. Who's Fawn? Foz? Who's Fawns? Who's the Fawns? Hey, Foz. How's life in Jin's rear echelon treating you? Brilliant. But then we can't all be off on some secret mission. Oh, yeah? How'd you hear about that? This is an army, not a monastery. Yeah, okay. Well, look, we'll just leave you to the very important work, punching machines. And sparring. Wow, rude. Hang on a second, shit stick. Shit stick? Del, theories? I don't know. Maybe a stick made out of shit? Or, or a stick you used to stir up shit. All right, fuck off. How about we make this interesting? You and me, spar right now. And how exactly is beating you interesting? Yes or no? <laughs> you want in on this? Pretty sure what's actually being measured here is gonna leave me at a distinct disadvantage. Then again, maybe not. Hilarious. Got him. Are you in or not? Oh, I'm in. I'm not in. Come on, man. Let's just grab a jack component and get out of here. No, this will be fun. How's that fun working out for you? Am I gonna do this? Try it again, Foss. Come on. Hey, here's the thing, Foss. The bottle's far with you, but not beat you. It's against their programming. But explain. Shit. Your false confidence. Quite a bit, actually. Want some advice, Phoenix? No, I'm good. Jin does love her golden boys. But never for very long. See, that was fun. Fuck off. All right, man. Now that Fa's fun time's over, I don't, can we go find that component? I don't know what that was about. I'm done with this day. And it's not even noon yet. Ah, <laughs> there's a component we're borrowing. Or stealing. I prefer borrowing. Indefinitely. I prefer borrowing. All right, let's see what it does. Boop. You found a component. Uh, highlight ability in your password, press X. Just give you one ability to upgrade, make sure you have enough components. Okay. I wish I could kind of like see what this is really doing. Whatever, right, let's upgrade. Oh, I see. Wait a minute. Um, uh, 
object is best such a programming task. Jack remain cloaked while carrying a weapon. Uh, creates an effective range. Creates an, uh, it's like an ultimate enemy that wants. Jack can fetch heavy weapons. Jack kills or charge Jack's abilities. Execution charge Jack's ability faster. Kills or charge Jack's ability slightly faster. Wow, 16 scrapper or whatever. That's range duration. So let's let's get the repair boost. Okay, it's just like a one-time thing. It doesn't continually get better. I'm gonna hold off on getting these active abilities until I find the one that I really like, because there's like seven, right? So <laughs> once we actually start getting all of them, then maybe it'll be worthwhile to upgrade them, since we'll Say, probably not get a lot yeah. of upgrade points. Can't wait to test them out in the field. Try to contain your excitement. We still have to go to Jin's office. Lancer, yeah, Lancer. Yeah, that's probably had long enough long time with her by now. <laughs> Never could get used to the field of viewing those things. Huh. All right, not this way. Hey, come on, enough's enough. You gotta see someone about these headaches. I will, I promise. After we talk to Jen. This is an obnoxiously, obnoxiously large button. Let me be perfectly clear. When it comes to this weapon, I don't share your optimism. It's the first time anyone's accused me of optimism. Yes, well, I'll remind you your wife refused the idea of bringing the hammer back online. I would have thought you'd respect Anya's wishes. I'm gonna pretend you didn't say that, for both our sakes. Anya would have wanted you, you to- You don't get to talk about her. If that's what you think, I won't argue. You and that goddamn fertility program. A program that gave you your son and mine. Oh. I honor Anya. I loved Anya. Oh. I don't care if you believe me. When my program was in its infancy, she came to me. She volunteered. Both times she volunteered. Seeing First Minister Stroud undergo treatment. Do you know how many children are alive today thanks to her? She should be buried here, you know, with the All-Fathers. The people need her inspiration. Your inspiration was my wife. First Minister, Lieutenant Phoenix and his squad. Send them in. Ah, Lieutenant. I'm told you had a successful mission. First Minister, I can explain. By all means, explain when Damon Baird superseded me. Explain how launching a Hammer of Dawn satellite doesn't require my explicit approval. Same page, huh? <laughs> Lieutenant, the Hammer of Dawn has taken more COG lives than most of the armies we've opposed. Your father knows this as well as anyone. It's not the weapons I don't trust, First Minister. It's the people who use them. The Hammer of Dawn will not be brought back online. Ah, that'll be a report on the evacuation of Settlement 2. Settlement 2 is being evacuated? Why? There's been activity in the nearby burial site. Chief Carmine, report. Chief Carmine. Please, slow down. Mobilize the 4th Division. We'll take command of the reinforcement effort. Do it. Go. Gears of War. Okay, cool. There's just more. Getting close. Where do you want me and Kate? Main gate. Keep anything else from getting inside. You realize I'm the ranking officer here, right? And we'll reinforce Carmine at the town hub. I 
can't believe we're back here. We did our duty. You need to get over it. Get over it? Guys, not the time. Cole, let's see what we're dealing with. Why is Cole here? That's a Brumac. Oh, shit! Now, let me just close the door. Wait, how did the pilot not see the Brumac? And immediately be like... Oh, well, we should fucking, like, turn. Get out! 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 Help! Run! Move your ass! Oh no, Whee! what about the pilots? Ah, nobody cares about them. Oh, my ankle's broken. Oh no, not the coal train. Oh, he's got grenades attached. JD, I can't see! I can't move! Just hang on, Cole! No, boss, we're pinned down here! We're coming! We got juvies up here! I've got juvies down, down here. here too. Keep them shits off us. I'm out of ammo. Go. Where are you guys? Go. Where are you? Hang on! We're coming as fast as we can! Not, not fast enough. Don't feel like it. We gotta get down there! They're gonna get ripped to shreds, mate! I know, I know! Ah, how we doing? It's so loud. I hate this game right now. Get this fucking thing off me! Am I supposed to press a button? That was the last one. Thanks. Now, get us out of here. Boss, get cold! Uh, thanks. Well, that sucked. Baird, look, our raven's down. You patch us through to Carmine? Uh, no can do, kid. His radio's out. He's okay? I can see him at the central hub, so he's up and fighting, but the swarm's all over him. Hurry if you can. Run our way. Come on, Delta. Let's get out of here. Oh, sweet, a component. Um. Wow, up's farther than they hoped. Then we better move it, Delta. We better move it. All right, through here. Ah, oh, shit. Baird, we got a swarm back in our location. I'll deploy DB units to take it out. Just get the car What do you call this? Swarm? Oh, right after we're done here. Goals are dug in. Jack, hit him with flash! No, I'll just shoot him. Okay, fine. If you just make this thing go away out of my screen. Gotcha! Oh, why don't I just shotgun this guy? What am I doing? Oh, it's because there's another shotgun guy. Oh, okay, you know? It wasn't as meaty as I thought it would be. Room's clear. All evac trucks, proceed immediately to the hub. No stopping. Lizzie, Delta here. There's a swarmac in the settlement. Keep your convoy away from it. Ah, oh, Delta. I was gonna do donuts around it. Be advised, Corporal. They're faster than they look. Delta out. Be advised, Corporal. Oh, look. Another component. Cool. I hate this.
Evac convoy. Yeah. Lizzie's from the speed of it. You're the best driver we got. Problem is, yeah, she knows it. Everybody, stay back. They're coming in. Hey, stand down, Private. We're gears. Oh, shit, sorry, Lieutenant. No harm, no foul. What are you doing? Man, you almost shot us. Uh, lost our DBs and we got civilians holed up in here. Lizzie, Delta requesting civilian pickup. Sector 8, apartment complex. Copy that, Delta. I'll circle back. Mm -hmm. Thanks for that, Lieutenant. What the fuck is this gonna do? No problem, Private. Come on, Delta. Oh, okay, it's got a component. Cool. Sorry again for the errant fire, Lieutenant. Yeah, keep your shit under control, dude. I'm glad you showed up when you did, sir. You guys here to pick us up? We're not, but the convoy's on the way. Careful out there, sir. Loco. Let's go, Delta. Well, that's a shiny thing behind here. I'm gonna take your uh, little magazine. Oh, your brochure, whatever. I'm gonna take your Les Paul. Don't mind me. 